February 11th, 2021. Well, a lot of people are seeing signs on the roads offering to buy your property. You get unsolicited offers. You get calls. To understand what's really going on is that right now, we, we realize that there's people being foreclosed on and people are being kicked out of their apartments and everything else due to the, uh, you know, the bug. But with the way that they're printing money, from an investor standpoint, buying your house at 20 or 30 percent below market value, say it's an older house and it needs a lot of work, or they're just offering it because it's in a hot market area to buy your house. The thing is, is that what you need to realize is that if I buy a house for $125,000 and they keep printing money, within a matter of months, that $125,000 house, which is, with it, which, would, if you fix it up, could end up being 175. Well, with the way inflation's going, they could easily market that house for a couple hundred thousand in the future, because money, the inflation's going up, and the value of the houses are going to go up. Because they're printing so much money, the money's becoming worth less. So if you're wondering why you're seeing all those signs on the side of the road and you're getting offers for your house, somebody wants to buy it, it's a group of investors. And what they're doing is they're taking that money that they have now and investing it into tangible assets. Because if you're holding cash right now, you're losing money. With the amount of money that they're printing from the Fed, for these stimulus checks and everything else. The value of the money that you're holding in your hand right now, so you have like five grand, okay, in your hand. Well, it's really decreasing in value every day with the printing of more money. They're flooding the market with money, currency, fiat currency. So that 5,000 today is gonna be really worth 3,500 in the future because you haven't grown that money you need to make that money 7500 just to keep up with the inflation that's coming. These investors know all this stuff, and that's why they're offering to buy your house now, even at market value, because they know that they buy your house, say, for $250,000, even at market value. They know it's going to go up 25000 in the next few months. Therefore, they'll make money. This is how they hedge against losing the value in the fiat currency. Now, I hope that makes a lot of sense to you because rich people don't think the same way as people that are just trying to pay off a mortgage. Rich people are upside down on their thoughts about debt. The more debt, the greater, because they can either rent that place or sell for a higher profit. And they can ask more for rent. And they can ask a higher price in the future. It kind of goes with house flipping. But also, if you wanted to become a real estate agent and have several properties that you actually rent, the rent that you would get from that would actually be in the plus. Because the mortgage never goes up. This is one country and also Canada that, you know, for the most part, when you buy something, it's what your loan is. They don't call you up the next day and say, hey, <laughs> money is a little bit worth a little bit less now, so we're going to have to raise your loan amount. They don't do that. So when they buy your house right now, and you can see the way property is just going like this, boom, 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 all over the place. Things are just getting sold within a day or two. This is what they're doing to hedge their, their, uh, their money supply, these investors, to keep them from losing money on holding cash. I hope this explains it to you. I mean, there's a lot of things you could go through in articles and read through all the BS, but... Usually a lot of these offers are legit, but you should always check them out. So the good news is if you're trying to sell and move to someplace else, it's probably a pretty good chance that you're going to be able to dump anything you want to on the market and it'll be gone within a week or two, unless you have some serious un underlying problems with the property. 
And, you know, they know that people have been out of work and some people are in foreclosure and there's a lot of people that are about to lose their homes and kicked out of apartments and everything else. But they're hedging their their bet against the fiat currency being flooded into the market becoming worth less by buying tangible assets. Just thought I'd give you a heads up because a lot of people have asked, why are there so many signs to offering to buy our property? Well, now you know. It's business. And rich people are upside down. The more debt they have, the more they make off of it. Because if they got a lot of debt, but they got a lot of renters for these properties they fix up, they're making an income off of that. Take care, y'all. God bless, and I hope this explains a lot to you. Thank mm-hmm. you.